One of the things that differentiate American Mahjong from all the other versions is its use of jokers. In this video, we're going to talk about the rules and strategies. I'm going to start with a refresher on when you can use jokers and when you can't. Then we're going to do a solitaire game and I'm going to talk through different scenarios that might come up in a live game and try to make some examples of the rules and strategy surrounding jokers. Let's do a review on jokers. Here's a hand on the mock card. This is going to be the last hand under the year category. It's concealed. We have a pair of flowers, a Kong of green dragons. Then we have two blocks of singles, the year and news. With the year, this was filmed in 2018, but this year could be any year. For example, let's just say it's 2025. This hand would apply on the mock card. Any year will do. The zero will always be a white dragon. In regards to the rules about jokers in blocks of tiles, you can use any number of jokers with a block of tiles made up of three identical tiles or more. So here we have a Kong of green dragons. You can use jokers here. That would be valid. You can use any number of jokers. They could all be jokers if you want. You do not have to have a natural tile in a block. They could all be jokers. In this case, I have the green dragon, so we'll just put that in there. You cannot use a joker for a pair in any block of single tiles, no jokers. So for example, this would not be valid. You cannot use a joker in a pair. You cannot use a joker for any of the single tiles. So for example, that is not valid. None of these can have jokers in them. Not valid because these are single tiles. Only here can you use a joker. If you have any questions, about when you can use a joker in your hand, write it in the comment section below. I'm gonna build the walls so we can start a game of solitaire. All my tiles are built into walls. This way we can keep track of the progress of the game based on how many tiles are left for picking. This is going to be critical when it comes to joker bait, which we'll get to shortly, I'm sure. I'm going to deal the tiles. East will get 14, south, west, and north will get 13 each. Everybody has their tiles. Let's see what we can do for East. Pair of greens, white, red. Why don't we try a year hand? Let's try a year hand. Now we don't need all these number tiles.
we might be able to play a two, four, six, eight hand. Two, eight, four, six, and a different suit. I'd like to hold this for joker bait to see if we can show how that'll work. Let's force joker bait here and play a year hand. Let's pass those. Joker bait is a term coined by Tom Sloper of Sloperama. I'll have a link below the video to the column where he introduces it to the community. Basically, joker bait is a block of tiles, usually two or more identical tiles, that you hold on to regardless of whether or not you're using those particular tiles. For example, let's say I have a pair of seven dots that I don't need because I'm playing little odds, one, three, five. I don't need seven dots, but I'm gonna hold on to them for as long as I can. Then later in the game, I will discard one and someone will make an exposure with a joker. On my next turn, I use that second seven dot and I exchange the joker. The key is timing. You've got to wait until probably the middle of the third wall and then test the table. You always got to be aware of what's happening at the table. Those sevens may or may not be needed, so it's hit or miss. But if you hold on to it till about the middle of the third wall, that's when everyone should have had a chance to build their hand and need those tiles. Discard one, and then someone will make an exposure, hopefully, with a joker. On your next turn, you exchange it. Now, sometimes they're not needed. So if I discard that seven dot and nobody wants it, then you know the next seven dot is probably a safe discard. Like I said, it's hit or miss. Joker bait would be tiles in some kind of multiple, whether it be a pair, pung, or kong, let's say. Hopefully you're gonna use it, but if you're not, keep it. And then during the pick and discard phase of the game, you discard one. If somebody makes an exposure with the joker, you can take it with the second. So let's see if we can make that happen. Let's play a year hand here. I'm thinking if I had to pick a hand, the very first one, we have a gap of no flowers. Maybe we should hold this. For a big year hand, but I'd like to use jokers. And you can't use jokers in a pair hand. All right, here we go. We're gonna look at South. We have two flowers and a joker. It'd be nice to use the flowers. We have an east and a green, one, seven, nine, three, four, five, seven, eight. I'm thinking we could maybe do something consecutive or one, three, five, seven, nine. Let's see, news is in a lot of hands, so Let's give up the eight and the one and focus on odds. And let's see what we can do for West. Winds and dragons for sure. Let's do it. So let's gather, oops, here, winds. We do have ones. Maybe we could play a year hand. Let's keep the one, maybe for joker bait, east and west with eights, winds and dragons. This would be the second from the bottom under winds and dragons. Let's pass those three, joker bait. If we're gonna play east and west with eights, we don't need the ones, so we can use those for joker bait. 
Kong of North. Maybe we could try to play North and South with Reds. Second hand from the bottom. Wind and Dragon hand or Year hand. In which case I'll keep all the ones and eights and we can pass those three. Okay, we have potential year hand or winds and dragons. Winds and dragons, dragons potential year hand. Odds, year hand. We're gonna do first right. East passes to south. South to west and west to north. North down to east. Incidentally, you can never pass a joker. It's on the rules on the back of the card. So we were looking for year tiles. Oh, look at what we got. A pung and a pear. So let's see if we can use this. And then we can use this as joker bait. If we play mix suit consecutive run, two, three, with an opposite dragon. We have no flowers is the problem. Let's pass the four. And the seven. Maybe we could play consecutive one with the three and the dragon and use the two as joker bait. We're looking for odds five seven and nine let's see what the odd hand is with news one three five or five seven nine with news five seven nine let's give up the three and focus on big odds five seven nine we've got an eight and here's an eight we've got a four to pass so we need to whittle down our options. Let's pass the green dragon and let's look at the east and west with eights is what we're thinking. Let's pass the one and hold this for joker bait. We could still play a year hand here with the one and the eight. We're looking for year tiles, we didn't get any. So now we're gonna go across. East and South Pass, and North and West. East and West Pass, North and South Pass. We got a two, one, two, three, or two, three, Ooh, we got a green dragon. Okay. 2018 with dragons. 2018 with dragons. All we need are flowers. And of course, more dragons. Let's pass those. Joker bait. We've got a five and a nine. Five, seven, nine, seven, nine, five, nine. Five, seven, seven, nine. Let's pass the east. Actually, maybe we should keep the east for the news hand. Let's go ahead and, and pass the nine bam. Cause we could do five, seven, seven, nine. I'd like to use the flowers though. Maybe we could do five, seven, nine in one suit with flowers or five, seven, nine. If we can get a red dragon, five, seven, nine red. We need a pung. We could use the joker to help us with that maybe. Here we're looking for eights and we got an eight. East and west with eights. Let's give up the east and hold that for joker bait. So east and west with eights is what I'm thinking here. East, west, eights in the middle. 
pairs. Let's pass those. We're looking for year tiles, north and south. North and south. North and south with red. Maybe with the year. So we went across, now we're gonna do first left. East passes up to north. North to west, west to south, south to east. We got the dragon. We have tiles to pass. Let's give up one of the three bams. This is still good joker bait. We got a seven crack. Let's pass the five bam. Five, seven, seven, nine. This would be the second hand down on the right. I still think it'd be better to use the flower though. Okay, we'll see. I think we can give up the east. Now we're going to look at east and west with eights. No keepers. Okay, we picked up a year tile. 2018. Let's pass those. We need a south. Pretty badly. We don't need these flowers though. I'm kind of thinking we should try to force north and south with reds. Let's pass those three and not worry about it. We're gonna go across now. Oh no, second left. Second left, east to north, north to west, west to south, south to east. No keepers. No keepers, although we did get a three. Maybe we could use it, it's odd. We needed eights and a west. We wanted south and red. That was second left, now we're going across. East and west, north and south. No keepers. We did get a nine, but we're focused here on two suits. Let's pass it. We got a north. We want a west. And eights. Here we got an east, we want south. Okay, we did a cross, now we're gonna do last right. This is when people can pass blind if you want. The last pass of each Charleston, first left, last right. In this case, we're gonna pass fully. North passes to east, east to south, south to west, and west to north. We've got no keepers and we maintained our joker bait for now. We've got a seven. I think definitely five, seven, seven, nine is a, a strong possibility or five, seven, nine with, or five, seven, nine, the mixed suit. This would be the hand that is third from the bottom, two flowers, five, seven, nine with red dragons. That's probably gonna be the strongest potential there. Just hold these for a while and see what happens. Five, seven, nine, dragon. So we can pass those. No keepers here. We got a north. And I think we could go ahead and give up on that. So north and south with the year north and south with dragons, red dragons specifically. Okay, we're gonna do optional cross. East passes to west, west to east, south to north, north to south. 
No keepers. We got the three back. No keepers there either. East and south or east and west with eights. We've got joker bait. We wanted year tiles and a south. So these we can pass or discard. Okay, we're done with the Charleston now, and we're gonna go into the pick and discard phase of the game. We've got joker bait here and here. So we're gonna watch the walls and discard those before the end of the third wall. We wanna hold on to them as long as possible. Let's discard the nine bam. And we're gonna draw south. If you're not using winds, get rid of them early. Not ready. Three dot, we can discard that. We can discard that. These are kind of all arbitrary in the beginning. We're gonna draw white dragon. Now we could use white dragons here, any two dragons. Any two dragon Kongs. So let's hold it. Maybe we'll get a joker. Let's discard the four dot. Here's a seven bam. I don't know if that's going to be helpful. Five, seven, nine. Let's discard the four dot. White, we need east and west with eights. We're gonna discard that. They're not ready here. Five crack. Nine crack. Not ready. If we play five, seven, seven, nine, this has to be a Kong. Four of a kind. Two dot. We got a flower. If we play east and west, if we get green dragons, we could play east and west with greens and use the one maybe. Let's discard the six crack. Four bam, two, four, six, eight is showing up a little bit. Let's discard the three dot. Two crack, I don't think that's gonna be helpful. We've got our year secured, we need flowers. Let's discard the two crack and hold on to the joker bait. Nine crack. Okay, I think five, seven, nine. Let's see, five, seven, nine. Five, seven, nine, red. That would use the flowers. We could use this as joker bait. Let's discard the one dot. Now, when somebody, we're gonna draw here in a minute, but when someone throws a discard, and it's the same tile as joker bait, and nobody acts on the discard, that joker bait may or may not be useful. So we'll have to keep an eye on that. It could just mean that people aren't ready at the table. So don't discount it immediately. Wait and see. In this case, we have a discard, so we don't have to decide yet. Three bam. Let's throw it. Three bam, and nobody wants it. And in this case, three bam, nobody wanted it, and so these probably will not be good joker bait. One crack, we need singles. Let's discard the one crack. Five crack. We've got a west here. Let's discard. 
not ready. You can't pick up a discard unless you're ready to complete a block, in which case you would expose those tiles to complete that block. So we're not ready for that west. Three dot. Joker, we needed that for south. North and south with the year. This could be joker bait, or we could play north and south with red dragons. We have no red dragons. Either way, we don't need the four dot. Let's throw that. Flower. We needed a flower here. Pair of flowers. The year, dragon pungs. Let's get rid of the three bam. And nobody wants it, so these are probably going to be safe tiles. That's a consolation with joker bait. If it doesn't work, then you know you have safe tiles. Most likely, I should say. It's not a guarantee. Six dot. We can discard that. And nobody can take the six dot. Eight crack, we got a keeper. Let's discard the four crack. And draw. Nine bam. Nobody can take a nine bam. We just got through the second wall. We're heading into the middle game, which is the third wall. Everybody should know what category they're in. We're playing a year hand, big odds, Winds and Dragons, and a Year Hand. Two Bam. Let's keep that and get rid of the three. Nobody wanted it. We can discard the six Bam. Five dot. Seven bam. Two bam. Joker bait. We're going to discard the three bam. So now we do not need two bam. So we're going to hold those, see if we can get a joker out of it. Three crack. One bam. Five crack. Red dragon. That's a keeper. Let's hold on to the joker bait. We need a joker here so we can Kong that. Let's discard the white dragon. One bam. Same. Woo! Nice. Let's discard that eight bam. I threw the white dragon earlier. You can't pick up a single tile. You have to draw those yourself. Six dot. Four bam. Seven dot. Seven bam. Six crack. Five bam. Five, seven, seven, nine. I think we should give up on that other hand and use this as joker bait. Let's throw the nine dot. We are heading into the middle of the third wall. This is when you want to start thinking about discarding joker bait. 
Everybody's had time to build their hand. They may be getting desperate for tiles. Let's draw. Three crack. Two dot. Let's just hold that and discard the six bam. It's good to have options. Drawing. Nine dot. Should be safe. Three crack. Red dragon. Discard. Not ready for it. Not ready for it here. Now, technically, we could take that. But we would ex expose three jokers in one, one exposure, and we have no south. I think I'd rather draw east. Let's get rid of the four band. Maybe we could switch to a news hand. And use the flowers as joker bait. Flower, we needed that. Let's throw the two bam. And nobody wants it, so that joker bait didn't pan out. Six dot. Four dot. Seven dot. Joker. Wow, they needed that. Two bam. Last of that little bit of joker bait there. We're ready on a red dragon. Eight dot. This is a pair, so we're good there. West. Now here goes joker bait. And in this case, nobody wanted it. So that's going to be a safe discard. One crack we can discard. Two bam. Five bam. Five, seven, seven, nine, joker bait, seven dot. Now we have one more pick in the third wall. These need to go next. Drawing here. Five dot. Drawing here. South. They got it. Two dot. They're one away. They need an eight crack and a white dragon. Here we go. One bam. Let's discard the flower. Last pick of the third wall. Nobody wants it. So flowers probably are safe in this case. We need red dragons here. We can get rid of these or switch to news. North, yeah, they can't, they don't have reds or we could do, they need a, they need a red dragon pretty badly. Okay, four, four, one, we're going to draw. Seven bam. Nine bam. We're into the fourth wall now. This is the end game. This is when you want to get rid of all your fresh tiles and joker bait if you're not using it. Right now, this is maybe joker bait. We, I don't think we have any fresh tiles. This is still a little risky because maybe someone's not ready for a flower. Okay, we're going to draw. Nine bam. Nine dot. 
joker. One dot. They're ready to win on an eight bam. No, we need to Kong the east or the west, discard the flower. They're one away. Joker. We have gaps. No eight crack, no white dragon. Let's switch to news. Two flowers, north, south. Maybe we could use these as red dragons. Let's discard the one crack. Look at all those jokers. Seven dot. Where's that red dragon? Two bam. South. We're going to call it. Discard. So they need a red or another joker. Two dot. There's some joker bait, and I believe it's out. Let's get rid of this flower. Risky tile. Any time during a game. Nine crack. We'll discard that. Let's Kong it. We need sevens. Let's discard the five dot. And it's this player's turn. Two crack. I should have gotten rid of that flower. We need to get rid of that. Five bam. Six crack. Five dot. Four crack. One dot. Four bam. We need a pung here. Pung Kong, Pung Kong. This is not helpful. There are six BAMs out. Let's go ahead and ditch the six BAM. Nobody wants it. Six dot. Oh, nope. Yep, I said it. Say it, and it's a discard. If it touches the table or you say it, it's a discard. We'll discard that next. Five crack. Three crack. Eight crack. Eight dot. Let's get rid of the flower. Nobody wants it. We have an eight dot here, so that's a discard. Four crack. Drawing here. West, discard. We're ready to win here. We're going to Kong it. Discard. Ready to win on an eight bam. So let's see. That was this player. We're up here now. Eight bam. Either way. We don't need either of these. Let's see. East, south. There are not very many winds out. And the eight bams, there's one out. Either way, it's risky. Eight bam. Mahjong. This player could have been playing east and west with green, a year hand, or east and west with eights. So either way, they had a risky tile. Because any time a Kong of east or west are out, you know they need the other one. So they were in trouble. 
ready to win on a red. Two away, couldn't get seven bams, couldn't get red dragons because they were down here. Joker bait is hit or miss. In this case, it didn't work out. If you have joker bait, just really, really watch the discards and the tiles in the wall because you want to make sure to get rid of them by the end of the third wall. Timing is critical in any game of Mahjong, but especially with joker bait. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed to my channel, consider subscribing. Click the little gray bell if you do, so you get notification for when I post new videos and you won't miss an opportunity to learn a new strategy or pick up an insight to the game that could give you an advantage at the table. Between now and the next strategy video, may all your picks be keepers.